What's up guys, Jay here, and uh, I hoped uh, that me getting back into the streaming uh, rotation would help if I stream my reaction to this direct that randomly showed up. So yeah, um, four, four minutes, so after this I'll just leave it to my own reactions to give you the prime entertainment that you've been looking for. Uh, any predictions I have would probably be more information on ZA. Probably some random spin-off mobile game. Uh, heck, throwing a Kirby game while you're at it. And maybe some more details on existing games, like maybe a Tears of the Kingdom DLC or a Splatoon free expansion. Yeah, maybe more of that Splatfest stuff. Hey, maybe even something about the, a new uh, Mario game. They said specifically nothing about the Switch's successor. So I wouldn't say there's going to be anything massive in this, but it's just good to wonder what's going to happen. A random curveball I'm going to say is they're going to add Star Rail to the Switch. And yeah, that'll be it. Um, I'll leave uh, the director to give the rest of the, the uh, entertainment off, and I'll uh, speak to you after the direct. See ya. Let's see what you got this time, Nintendo. Good Mario game, there you go. Luigi? Is that the Mario and Luigi series? The like RPG the series that everyone likes? Brothership. Yeah, this is a new edition. Like, I think this is the first new edition since, uh, oh, I don't know. Hello, everyone. Hi. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. That was the first new entry in the Mario and Luigi series in almost nine years. Wow. Mario and Luigi Brothership. Please look forward to a seafaring adventure that unfolds across mysterious islands, as well as evolved bros moves with Mario and Luigi. <coughs> okay, let's see the first batch of headlines. Go on, man. Bring the championships home, or on the go. The thrill of the Nintendo World Championships is heading to the Nintendo Switch system. Take on over 150 speed-running challenges from across 13 NES games, from lightning-fast beats to action-packed battles. Familiarize yourself with each challenge and perfect your timing. Then give it your best shot and aim for the top of the online leaderboards. You can also try more difficult legend challenges. So it's like competitive? Like completing uh, Super NES. Mario Brothers in one go using warp pipes. 
Stuck on a legend challenge? Check out classified information for handy tips and tricks to help you improve. Put your skills to the test in survival mode, where you'll race against ghost data of players worldwide. After each round, half of the players will be eliminated. You've only got one shot to survive. Will you be the last one standing? This Nintendo is. World Championships NES Edition launches on Nintendo Switch July 18th. Pre-orders for the digital version are available now on Nintendo eShop. A deluxe set containing a physical version of the game and other bonus items is also Jesus. available for pre-order. The final battle of Fairy Tale is about to begin. Something about Fairy Tale, I don't know. Ikuto, happy! Nice Relive the climactic Alvarez Empire arc from the hit anime Fairy Tale in this action RPG. Set in the vast kingdom of Fiore, Team Natsu prepares to finish their fight. Engage in real-time battles and unleash powerful attacks that fuse different kinds of magic based on who's in your party. Work together with your teammates to take down powerful enemies. Fairy Tale 2 launches on Nintendo Switch this winter. I'm sorry, no, I'm not a fairy tale guy, I don't get any of that. Embark on a multi dimensional journey. From Final Fantasy series creator Hironobu Sakaguchi and composer Nobuo Uematsu comes the turn based RPG Fantasian. Fantasian. The world is slowly being robbed of its civilization. To restore his memories, Leo must confront an evil entity threatening all mankind. His skills are the ticket to winning battles. Adjust a skill's trajectory to target multiple enemies at once. Huh? You can also send enemies you've encountered to a separate dimension and fight them later. Yeah, the more enemies there right are, now. the more you can wipe out in one shot. Let them go! Now, let us save the world together. Fantasian Neo Dimension launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. I can have a fun that one. Another sport is coming to Spoko Square. Oh. Basketball. Basketball is being added as a free update to the Nintendo Switch sports game. I thought they already about Dribble, that. pass, and shoot. In two on two matches using motion controls. Try out three point challenge solo and score as many baskets as you can within the time limit. Up to four players can also compete in five streak battle. Besides local play, you can team up with players worldwide in two on two so online free. matches. This free update for Nintendo Switch Sports dunks its way onto Nintendo Switch this summer. I haven't got that yet. Played the game as always. Well. Mio, memories in orbit. 
It's an array of cartoon classics. Leap into a new update for Disney Illusion Island. Monoth's greatest detective is solving a mystery, and only Mickey and friends can help. In the brand new adventure, Mystery and Monoth, uncover hints and evidence scattered throughout the world, then use the dashboard to crack each case. What big secret lies at the end? Start sleuthing, because this free update launches on Nintendo Switch later today. Hello, Kitty. Island adventures await. I play like the island bitch. Customize your character. Then befriend Hello Kitty, Karomi, and other familiar faces in this open world adventure. Team up with your new pals to solve mysteries and restore Friendship Island when Hello Kitty Island Adventure launches as a time actually, console exclusive on the Nintendo Switch system next year. Let's get loony in this wacky sports game. Play as Bugs Bunny, Daffy Duck, Porky Pig, and more across four arcade-style sports. Unleash the full power of Acme across iconic levels in up to four-player local co-op. But watch out for falling anvils. Looney Tunes' wacky world of sports crashes onto Nintendo Switch this fall. What's up, Doug? That's all, folks. Let's see if you can be a, be a game on. <laughs> Emergency meeting. New crewmate and imposter roles are being added to Among Us. Alert others when eliminated as a noisemaker. Plant tracking devices on others as a tracker. Or turn invisible while taking out players as a phantom. Suss things out when this free update for Among Us sneaks onto Nintendo Switch later today. A monster army is at your command. This is Felicidad, a realm of monsters. Those who command and raise them are called Farmagia and play a vital role in the land's civilization. Ten of Farmagia must rise up against the oppressive Magus to stop his vicious reign of the underworld. Raise monsters and lead them into the fight against the Magus's army. It's Pikmin Plant makes a Pokemon. Then cultivate and harvest them to make your buddies come to life. Mix of bug snacks. They can then be trained for battle. This is weird. Give commands to your monsters and exploit enemy weaknesses in action-packed combat. Merge all of the battle buddies in your party to call forth a giant fusion summon and wreak havoc on your foes. Join the rebellion to stop the Magus in Farmagia, launching on Nintendo Switch November 1st. I'm not sure about that one. Donkey Kong Country. Donkey Kong Country Returns, originally released on the Wii system, is barreling onto Nintendo Switch in HD. The villainous Tiki Tak tribe has hypnotized the local wildlife and stolen Donkey Kong's precious banana hoard. Banana. I want banana. Obstacles in the way? Just stomp them, pound them, and roll on through. Each level is filled with hijinks, but they're no match for these top bananas. From manic mine carts, to high-flying rocket barrels, and even hitching a ride on Rambi. There are plenty of transportation methods available. I've never played this game before, but... Let's Pass see. a Joy-Con controller to a buddy for two-player local co-op. 80 appealing levels are in store, <laughs> including the additional levels from the Nintendo 3DS version. Donkey Kong Country Returns HD swings onto the Nintendo Switch system Definitely January 16th. One of Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong's jungle escapades returns in HD. Plenty of wild actions and antics are in store with these Kongs. Next, please take a look at this.
The time is nigh. Now, Dragon Quest. Nothing on. The hour awakening draws near. Dragon Quest 3 remake. I always come out with a remake for some of the Dragon Quest games. Journey with allies to face the arch fiend on an epic adventure. Memorable encounters. Perplexing challenges. Ooh, terrifying. And formidable monsters await. An iconic RPG remade in HD 2D. HD 2D. Forge your <coughs> own path. <coughs> the oh, legacy goodness. begins. Dragon Quest 3 HD 2D Remake. I get paid lots Coming of money to for Nintendo playing. Switch, November 14th. I get paid lots of money for using this voice. <laughs> and I just get a cough. <coughs> now what? Nintendo Direct to Goran Minasoma. Konnichiwa, Hori Yuji des. Konnichiwa. Dragon Quest 3 no ezo, Ikaga de Staga. Yuyaku Hatsubai Biu Hapio de Kite, Boku Mureshko Mimas. So she take Kyo, Surprise the Hapio Star. Dragon Quest 1 and 2 mo, ATD 2 di de Yumere Kutuga, Kete Shimasta. Jikere de Tsushiwa, 3 ga Murgata de Hajibir to Natori, 3 1 2 no Jumban de Play Shimaroto. あっと驚く展開が待っています。ロト、3部作となる3と1と、どちらも無事楽しんでもらえたら嬉しいです。どうも、ホリーユーズでした。Thank you, Mr. Hori. We hope you're excited to play the entire Erdrick trilogy now in HD 2D. Let's continue with more headlines. Go on. Let's have some fun, Co. The Funko Pop game. Say hello to Jaws. Wait, He-Man? Great Scott! Is that Marty McFly? The world of Funko is coming to life in this action-adventure mashup for the ages. Play with more than 60 characters as you explore locations based on over 20 iconic movies, TV shows, and more. Use special skills and crafted gadgets to explore epic worlds, each with their own unique puzzles, hidden areas, and familiar foes. Dinosaurs from Jurassic World and Cylons from Battlestar Galactica, they're certainly not toying around. Unbox the universe when Funko Fusion pops onto Nintendo Switch September 13th. This looks like such a mean choice, though. We've got a smorgasbord of spooky, silly, and strategic games. Ready for an adventure of ghoulish proportions? Summon your courage Hello? and explore multiple mansions filled with goofy ghosts, tricky traps, and other supernatural shenanigans. Luigi's Mansion 2 HD launches on Nintendo Switch June 27th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. Meet the quirky little Dempa Man. Find him, catch him, and lead him on a joyful RPG adventure. Explore dungeons and battle monsters. Customize all sorts of outfits. 
decorate your island however you'd like, and more. Plus, up to four players in local co-op can team up to catch special Dempaman. The new Dempaman is free to play and launches as a timed exclusive on Nintendo Switch July 22nd. It's a free to play game. Strategize away in this tower defense installment of the Metal Slug series. Take control of your forces and pulverize enemy strongholds. Choose from over 300 units with different abilities and build out your decks to win tactical tussles. You can also slug it out with other players in online battles. Metal Slug Attack Reloaded storms onto the Nintendo Switch system later today. Embark on an expedition of the damned in this eagerly awaited sequel to the gothic roguelike RPG. Board your stagecoach and set off across a decaying landscape to prevent an apocalypse. Fight off nightmarish fiends in turn-based combat. And upgrade your abilities after each deadly run. Darkest Dungeon 2 launches on Nintendo Switch July 15th. Pre-orders begin later today on Nintendo eShop. Looks cool. More classic titles are on the way. Okay, this is to be expected. Link to the past four swords. Play Link's classic 16-bit adventure and team up online to explore randomized dungeons in The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past Four Swords. Okay, that's funny. Ooh, Experience Metroid the Zero remake Mission. of Samus's first adventure in Metroid Zero Mission. Plus, coming to the new Nintendo 64 Nintendo Switch Online Mature 17 Plus collection of games. Brave the dangerous lost land to stop the campaigner's nefarious schemes in Turok Dinosaur Hunter. And Perfect Dark. Infiltrate a corporation to end their alien conspiracy in Perfect Dark. Now with online multiplayer. All four games will be available for Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members later today. I'm sure someone's excited about that. Set sail to save the day. This is Verona, a young woman with the ability to communicate with phantoms. Hmm. I will take all of this girl. Join her on a journey to save her friend Ash. Ash. In this new installment in the Phantom Brave series. Take on tactical turn-based battles where you'll combine the phantoms you befriended with objects in various ways. Okay. Combine phantoms with certain objects to maneuver them. Combine with a cannon to attack a large area. A fan to blow enemies around. Or Combine with Morona herself for show-stopping abilities that can turn the tide of battle. Ooh. Phantom Brave, the Lost Hero, launches on Nintendo Switch next year. This one's gonna take you for a ride. Yeah, Street Fighter. Seven arcade games featuring Marvel and Capcom characters are fighting their way onto Nintendo Switch as one collection. Clash in X-Men vs. Street Fighter. Duke it out in Marvel vs. Capcom 2 New Age of Heroes. Take down the Kingpin in the beat em up side scroller The Punisher and more. Hit up training mode to polish your fighting skills and combos. Oh God. Select online mode to challenge rivals around the world. or play co-op in The Punisher. You can also cross over to the museum to view artwork or listen to music from each game. I wanna take you for a ride. Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Collection Arcade Classics launches on Nintendo Switch this year. Oops, 
Super Mario. The latest game in the Mario Party series takes place on an enormous island resort. Get ready oh, to jump no. into the biggest selection of Mario Party minigames yet in Super Mario Party Jamboree. First, let's see some of the new boards where you'll compete to collect the most stars. I know this is technically a good Take thing, the escalators but... to travel between floors in Rainbow Galleria. Use in game coins to get a star at half price when they're on flash insane. sale. But act fast. Ride around and stay on track mm -hmm. in Rollum Raceway. Okay, this is with cool. the new Turbo Dice item. You can move up to 40 spaces with a lucky roll. That's cool. Here on Goomba Lagoon, the ebb and flow of the tide can change your path. Mm. And things really get mixed up when the volcano blows its top. Mm. Along with five new game boards, two boards from previous Mario Party games make their return. That's a cool idea. Some mini games are action packed challenges, speed trials, a battle of wits, and more. And some are controlled by gently shaking or tilting your Joy Con controllers. With over 110 mini games, there's a wide variety to enjoy. Also, up to 20 players can go head to head online in the Coupathlon mode. Compete against your rivals and aim for first place. So like Larry Wemma? Try your best to come out on top. Wait, there are even more new modes? The biggest Mario Party yet will soon be underway when the Super Mario Party Jamboree game launches on the Nintendo Switch system <laughs> October die. 17th. That's gonna die when we play that. That was the latest installment in the Mario Party series. Super Mario Party Jamboree, with new boards, mini games, 20 player online gameplay and more, get ready for the biggest Mario Party in series history. And now, please take a look at this. I'm Eiji Aonuma, producer of The Legend of Zelda series. What you just saw was the latest installment, The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. This time around, Link has vanished. Now it's up to Princess Zelda to step into the protagonist role. You might be thinking, will Zelda fight with a sword then? No. Here, we wanted to create a new gameplay style that breaks conventions seen in past Legend of Zelda games with a top-down perspective. To explain more, please take a look at this video. Stolen away. Across the vast lands of Hyrule, strange rifts have appeared and have taken many people, including Link. Now alone, Zelda meets the fairy Tri, receives a mysterious staff called the Tri-Rod, and sets off on a journey across Hyrule to save her kingdom. Hmm. I like the concept. By waving the Tri-Rod at a table she found, Zelda learned how to create an imitation of it called an Echo. 
Once you learn an echo of something, you can recreate it whenever you'd like. Even if there's a wall blocking your path, you can create echoes of tables to get a leg up. Just like that. I like that. You can create wooden boxes, old beds, and unusual things like water blocks. How you use them separately or together is entirely up to you. Learn and create echoes of things you find while exploring Hyrule. You might be surprised at what you discover. Even battles will look different. You could pick up and throw a rock echo, for example. That's not all, though. You can also create echoes of monsters. After doing so, they'll fight by your side. Monsters have different abilities, so choose the one you want to create based on the situation. Wisdom is key, after all. I like the concept of the game. Nothing I'll play it though, because um, I am not a uh, Legend of Zelda fan. In a Hyrule without Link, the fate of the kingdom is now in Zelda's hands. How was that? I hope you enjoyed this demonstration of the Echo ability, which channels Princess Zelda's wisdom. There are a lot of Echoes in this game. To be honest, I haven't counted them all yet. <laughs> How you solve puzzles and battle enemies will change depending on the echoes used. In short, we've created a game where each player's experience will be different. The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom launches yeah. September 26th. I even I won't play the game, the I Nintendo like the Nintendo Switch Lite system <laughs> inspired by the Legend of Zelda series will also be available at launch. We hope you're looking uh, forward to playing as Zelda in this new adventure. Fuck you, Zelda fans. Here's now, something to I'd destroy like to return wallet. this moment I'd stolen away back to Mr. Takahashi. Thank you, Mr. Aonuma. Please look forward to the newest entry in the Legend of Zelda series. Let's see a few more headlines. Mm, come on. Let loose and party on. Another Just Dance, really? A new LEGO adventure is on the horizon. It's the world of Horizon in LEGO form. Join Machine Hunter Aloy on a quest to save the world from an ancient evil. Journey through lush landscapes. Dive deep into the cauldrons. Climb up onto tall necks and traverse other locations inspired by the original game. But be careful. Swarms of machines are lurking everywhere. Use an array of gadgets like blast boots and gravity bombs to hunt them down. I'm From the sure nimble watchers to mighty sawtooths. You might even come across the fearsome Thunderjaw. As you progress, you can help Aloy rebuild her home and customize her appearance with lots of outfits. Oh, and you don't have to explore this vast wilderness alone. Team up with familiar faces from the world of Horizon in two-player local or online co-op. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm not a big fan of this. So it's so Lego Horizon Adventures launches to. on Nintendo Switch this holiday. A stray's journey begins. Stray's being added to Switch.
Experience a decaying cyber city through the eyes of a cat, separated from their family and friends. Explore alongside a drone known as B-12 to find your way home. Carefully climb to the highest heights. Create new paths for yourself. And stealthily squeeze into tight spaces. Think like a cat to make your way through the city. Careful though. Not everyone is excited to have you slinking around, including hordes of hostile creatures ready to swarm. Keep exploring to venture into more areas of this unfamiliar world and make your way back to safety. Stray finds its way onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Welcome home, Hobbit. A Hobbit game. If you've ever wanted to live like a hobbit from the Lord of the Rings, now a leisurely existence nestled away in an idyllic, quiet corner of Middle Earth can be yours. Care is gonna love Customize us. your appearance, decorate your home, and settle into life in the Shire. As a newcomer to the little haven of Bywater, you'll befriend your neighbors, work together to solve problems, and even share a meal or three. Explore garden, fish, forage, and cook. The best way to build a Hobbit community is by hosting a dinner party with your homemade dishes. Plus, you can trade with your neighbors for unique decorations or special ingredients for even tastier meals. Friendly Hobbits and familiar faces await your arrival when Tales of the Shire launches on the Nintendo Switch system this holiday. Kira's gonna love that. Investigate, interrogate, Checkmate. Objection! Two Ace Attorney spin-off games, including a sequel that was previously unreleased outside of Japan, are coming to Nintendo Switch as one collection. Right. As the prolific prosecutor Miles Edgeworth take the case out of the courtroom and investigate crime scenes, gather information by interviewing people and inspecting evidence, then use the power of logic to solve challenging cases. Enjoy all new hand-drawn character visuals from the original series character designer, or swap to the original sprites for a more classic look. Take a break from your investigation to explore the gallery, where you'll find character art, music, including orchestral arrangements, and more. Past and present collide as you uncover the truth at any cost. Ace Attorney Investigations Collection launches on Nintendo Switch September 6th. Uh, Pre-orders begin later today on Nintendo eShop. Oh. I like I like the characters man. Oh, wow, that's nice. Casually the brick the bridge gives in. After a devastating attack by unknown assailants, Takumi Samino's life gets turned upside down. A mysterious school mascot suddenly appears. While Takumi manages to get out of harm's way, he's then forced to enroll at the Last Defense Academy, along with 15 other students. <laughs> Their mission is to defend the school from hostile student enemies for 100 days. An academy shrouded in secrecy. <laughs> and the unavoidable loss of allies can Takumi survive this 100-day trial, colored by extreme and despair, and return to his normal life? The creators of Danganronpa present The 100 Line Last Defense Academy, launching on Nintendo Switch early next year. <laughs> that was random. Embark on a saga spanning generations. A full remake of Romancing Saga 2 is marching on to Nintendo Switch. 
rule and expand the empire of Varen across multiple generations while challenging the legendary seven heroes who have turned to darkness. In combat, use returning saga features like glimmers to learn skills and formations to enhance abilities. Turn-based battles have also evolved into timeline battles, where the action order is key. Innovative features like United Attack can also help with strategy. How will you expand your empire? And in which order will you fight the seven heroes? Every decision you make will dramatically alter the course of the story. Safeguard your empire's future and protect your legacy from peril. Otherwise, the vengeful seven heroes may emerge victorious. Romancing Saga 2, Revenge of the Seven, launches on Nintendo Switch, October 24th. Weird. We hope you're excited to experience the full remake of Romancing Saga 2. That's almost everything for today's Nintendo Direct. Next will be our last announcement. Right. Please take a look. Fingers crossed, it's anything decent. Galactic Federation Research Facility. Star Fox or... Is this Metroid Prime 4? No, it, no sign of it being on the new on the old switch. So maybe. That ah, was no a first look at Metroid Prime 4 Beyond. After a very long time, we are finally able to share more information about this title. Release is planned for 2025. So please wait a little bit longer. We hope you're looking forward to Samus Aran's new adventure. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. All right, that's what they've got in store for us this year. Yeah, I guess I kind of got a bit my hopes a little bit up seeing some Pokemon uh, information since we haven't got anything from Zia yet. But hey, what are we gonna do? Alright, since the direct's done, we'll do finish things here. Oh, thank you, Nintendo, for a nice presentation like that. But yeah, um, thank you all for watching the stream today. And if you guys are up on uh, YouTube watching this, thank you for watching that. Um, let me help, Let me know in the comments if you are excited with anything that was announced there. And uh, yeah, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. See ya.